<laughs> Hello everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to Tasting with Friends. Actually, this this is less of a tasting with friends and more of a review. So this is something uh, a feature that we want to add to our playlist. Our vast playlist. Our vast playlist. Absolutely. Um, mm -hmm. So I was at the liquor store and I asked, hey, what's new and exciting? And the the owner said, well, I got these two in. So and I'm going to try and pronounce this. <laughs> Correct me in the comments. Um, so this is Lincoln Pinch, which is a um, two products made by um, Dueling Grounds Distillery in Franklin, um, Kentucky, which is in Simpson County, Kentucky. And they make two bourbons um, and a couple of gins and a white dog, I believe. So what we are tasting and reviewing tonight is their Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey Four Years Bottled in Bond Small Batch and their Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey Four Years Four Years it, just, um, yeah, cast Single Barrel Cast Strength. Oh. Yeah. Ooh, we so, like that. So this yeah. one clocks in at 119.5 proof, mm -hmm. and this is barrel number 85, or excuse me, 82. Nice. And so that's what we're going to, to do. The other one doesn't have that on there, huh? No, but, it's yeah. no because it's oh. uh, just a small batch. Oh, okay. Small batch no. and 100 proof, so you don't need to put. So we did read a little bit on this, and I know you got some notes, but the the tasting notes yeah. that we've seen, they sound pretty good. They yeah. sound pretty good. Yeah. So. What kind of history do you have on this place? So the name of the distillery, which is Dueling Grounds, mm -hmm. comes from the fact that, and if I scroll down to where I actually put my notes on that. It's a beautiful bottle. Uh, yeah, it's cool. Mm -hmm. Nice cool. Oh. So the, bur uh, the distillery is named for the Lincoln Pinch, Lincoln Pinch Farm, which is where a lot of duels took place in the day. Like shoot 'em up duels, because yeah, like what's on the front up. of the bottle two, yeah, two, uh, yeah. are that two little Derringer, oh, not Derringer. What are they? And then I was gonna say pistols, rifles, whatever. They're pistols, but they're they the pistols? old style. Yeah, that's kind of cool though. This yeah. looks. The bottle is very old western. I mean, I know. not cool. overly old western, but yeah. It's neat, like though. an old belt buckle kind yeah. of thing. Yeah. Now the distillery is on the um, uh, craft tour um, trail, so, and it's the first stop on the northbound section of the craft trail in Kentucky. So we have the Bourbon Trail, the Bourbon Trail in Kentucky. Then you have the craft, the craft Bourbon Trail. Bourbon Trail. So, oh, there's two. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Oh. And then within the craft, there's like four regions. Oh. And okay. they're in the north region. Great. Okay. Great. We need another And shelf. obviously they're all we craft need shelf. distillers. Yeah. So what makes them a craft versus a regular? I mean, just smaller scale or what? They like to do things with their hands and cut things Arch, out. Glue, and paint, glitter. You know. <laughs> Crafty. Craft distilleries. <laughs> I guess what makes a craft distillery is just the size, yeah, smallness of it. Yeah. yeah. I mean, what did you say they make? Two barrels a week? I think it was said, uh, yeah, but two barrels a week or something like that. I watched somebody else um, doing some reviews on it, mm. so. pretty. They're pretty small, but, I mean, well, I guess the people in that area, I mean, it's just like Journeyman around here, right? We know about it, but a lot of people probably don't mm -hmm. outside our area, so. What I like about this already, it's got like a little medallion on it, and it yeah. kind of sort of reminds me of Smoke Wagon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Know? Yeah. Sure. So, no, oh, it's like metal medallion. Yeah, it's metal, yeah. Both of them have it. It's a cool bottle. Yeah. And now for the fun part. Hopefully the juices is good. It looks yeah. like a nice wood cap too. Ooh. Or a cork there. Mm -hmm. The cork oh, yeah. top. So there's that one. Mm -hmm. Honey, oh. dispose of this. And then this. There you go. <laughs> nice. I, I my, knew that was going to happen. Great job. <laughs> Clean up crew again. That's, yeah. that's how he does Christmas presents or any presents. He all of them go. 
can sometimes make quite the mess. Yeah, the cleanup crew. Again. He gave me anxiety when I saw him do this with all his stuff all over yeah. the room. I'm like, oh no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. Total. That one's emblem is like a uh, oh, yeah. old style uh, okay. pocket watch. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh neat. And this one I'm gonna say is a barrel. Well, let me see. It kind of looks. Barrel like end. It's glaring a little bit. That's pretty. It good also kind. Oh yeah, like a barrel head. Yeah. Mm, they did a good job. That's I put cool. close ups right yeah. here and there. Or there, or there, nice. or there. Close enough. Or not at all. <laughs> all right, so let's. My thought was is we pour both. Yeah. And then. Try one at a time. You pour? No, you don't get to pour. <laughs> That's the only way I get the taste. We're only doing two. Whoa. You still don't pour well. Lincoln Pinch. Here. That is a mouth. You get to pour the other one. Oh, that, oh, was, that was even better. Wait, that's what Which I would side? pour. Isn't that like my pour? Which side are you putting it, left. Mike? Left, mm -hmm. left. No, you, you're side. in the right. Right. No. You're in the right. No. right. Well, you. Because I've got oh, different one. Yeah. <laughs> yep. He, he's so smart. Well, yep. Bottled and bottled oh, is on the left. You gotta keep them straight. Or left. Yeah. Give me a little bit more. There you go. Yep. Oh, it smells good. I know, I can smell it already. I wasn't even trying it. I can just no. vapor. Mm. I'm cheating. Yes, sir. Ooh. Dun, dun, dun. That's that cork. Wow, that one's almost like a... Finished, man. Mm. It's you can drink some of my... <laughs> what? He cheated you? I cheated her. Oh, uh, it's not too bad. You can always it's add. Not too bad. You can always add. Okay, so right. this is Ooh. the cast drink, and this is the small batch. Correct. Okay. Yep. Like as long as it's not in right line with our faces. Yep. <laughs> we're good. Of course, I think we're tall enough. Poor Nina was still like... Aww. <laughs> so yeah. Small batch first, obviously. Yeah. Which yeah. is the one on the right. Wrong. No. That's small Wrong. batch. Our, our... Oh, that's right. That's single barrel. Yeah. Right. Audience. Yeah. Left to us. But yeah. We have an audience, yeah. A couple people. Hmm. What is that? It's like a ethanol y smell mm -hmm. up licorice. front. Licor is it licorice? Like a licorice? That's a licorice to me. Oh. My nose feels like it's broke. Huh. I get good. vanilla. Mm hmm. I would agree. But the very first, as I was bringing it to my nose, I get like ethanol and then I get the, yeah. all the flavors. Mm hmm. And, there's, there's and that might be the proof. That might be. Here, actually, really. no, that's the proof. It's not your typical bourbon nose, though. No, yeah. I mean, no, it's, 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 yeah. It's, it's, is it? I don't think I've ever said smooth smell, but you know what I mean. It's very. It's got a good nose. It's just. It's just different. I yeah. mean, it, to me, it's a sweet smell. Let's find out. Vanilla and licorice. It's not like it has legs, but it is stuck to the sides of the glass. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, like the pattern on it is... And they're clean, by the way. I did clean <laughs> yeah. them. Yeah, well, that might be some water. By pot. hand, not in the dishwasher with... <laughs> what's that? Rinse stuff. Rinse egg. Cow gone. No. no. Do you get, like, a grape out of it at all? Ooh, well, you know what? You oh, should, when you swirl yeah. that around, boy, you, you open get, that up. You get some... Oh, yeah. Much get, different. Mm -hmm. You get a lot of fruits. I almost got, yeah. a, I almost got a raisin smell, too. Well, yeah. yeah. Yep. Yeah, I would agree. Huh. Yeah, I get... Don's going in for a try. Oh, and now we'll taste. <laughs> I should again. I didn't. I didn't warm up, so now I gotta take the first one to get my mouth all fired. Well, the the taste goes along with the nose. It's not yeah. your typical bourbon. Yeah. Not. It yeah, that's, it's it's good. It's just. It's really it's definitely different. It's yeah. not too sweet. It's sweet, but it's yeah. not too sweet. It's just. No. I get like a char taste and um, mm. a licorice taste for me. Yeah. At least the first taste. Hmm. Hmm. Now I'm smelling kind of grassy. Yeah. Well, that's me. I was I was picking up to me. I was picking up strong grassy straw. I get a little bit grassy. Wow. Something's at something's at the end. I can't identify. It's like a mint at the end. Mm. Like the finish of a mint something. Mm, nah, not for me. It's still grassy. It's definitely. a mini, it's an ethanol -y mint like your, I mean, I, I get your mint, I get the mint when you're getting it. I know, it's it, just so. open, so once it... Yeah. yeah. Now these, these are pot stilled, so 
the pot still them itself that process is going to really create a lot of those those tastes because it keeps all the esters mm. um, I got some heat. in the um, in the, in the liquid so all the mm. heat's right in my yeah I feel throat. quite a bit of heat it's here right for that here. only um, being a hundred no no hug it's just all like just settling in my only a hundred that's hot <laughs> I mean a hundred's hot <laughs> But it's only 100. It's not like we're 125 girls, but we totally are. Right. We totally are. <laughs> I like that. It's. Yeah, I like it's that. It's not sweet. sweet. I mean. It's not overly sweet. But this smells. And it makes you think about it. I mean, it's mm -hmm. it's it's not like, here's the taste, you like it or don't. Yep. It's like, here's something, here's something else, and somewhere in between. And I've had three taste now and it's each one's been just a little different, different. Huh. there's that, definitely some heat i'm holding it in my mouth longer so it's a little that third one was like real smooth yeah well smooth. yeah <laughs> As, I, I mean it's not burning like it was in the beginning yeah. obviously oh yeah the third one was it's like i'm not feeling it down here i'll just like, think it's right. happens but i like that right. i like something you go keep going back and it just changes a little bit Huh. All right. Yeah, as I, would, as I drink it more, I get more of a. Try know, the next one. Let's move on to the big boy. Oh, the big one. I'm saving some. So, this is the 119, because again, we're going from low proof to high proof. Yeah. Not that 100 is low proof by any stretch of the imagination. Nope. But in our repertoire, it kind of sort of is. <laughs> okay. But this one doesn't. Well, it kind of sticks to the. But not as much as that one did, because that one's still stuck to my glass. I just hope I don't spill it. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. Vanilla. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, very strong vanilla. Oh. Mm. I get Ooh. a little bit of some of this in it, but... Mm. I, I definitely get, get brown the, sugar. Yep. Yeah, brown sugar. A licorice in this one, too, I think, for me. Well, it's just sweet. That's got some ethanol, like, vapors in there, too, quite a bit. Mm -hmm. That smells really good, though. Hmm. Mm, the vanilla smells delicious. And everyone knows I love vanilla. <laughs> well, the sweetness is right up like front. A, mm, that's, like, ooh. It's so sweet on your tongue. Right? That is not it's even like that's not even hot like the first one. <laughs> that's like candy on the... Holy crap. That is good. Ooh, yeah. That Very. is smooth. I mean, I know people <laughs> don't like that, but... Yeah. For no. being 119 proof? Yeah, it just, the proof does not hit you wow. at all. Like I got a little tiny little heat on the tip of my tongue for this. That's it. This could oh, be no. dangerous. <laughs> I was just surprised. I felt more that's, from this than my Me too. Than this. That's a dawn. This could be dangerous. <laughs> oh yeah, it could be dangerous. <laughs> for sure. I was just surprised how sweet it was on my tongue mm -hmm. rice. Yeah. Mm. Wow. For yeah, definitely, it definitely hits me in the back of my throat. Not down here, just the back yeah. of my throat, mm -hmm. and then it stays there. Mm -hmm. I would agree. And then that long finish. Like you said, not in your chest, just yeah. in your throat. Mm -hmm. the, the finish is great. Mm. Now there is some, de <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> there's definitely some grassy notes in that though. The there's second some time light, I drank it. Some light grassy notes, yeah. <coughs> I, I, get a I would bit, agree too. A little bit of. The bourbon cough, <laughs> like it's ice a, cream. <laughs> that's a good grassy though. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's enough. It's it's not like it's super complex, but there's enough there. It changes a mm -hmm. little bit, you know? And I was also was just going to say, you know, like when you were a kid and like before I ate like straight butter, like we always used margarine and crap like that. Still, still but gonna, if you take a, like a bite of butter and it kind of made you kind of like shiver a little bit because it was so rich mm -hmm. in your throat, that's what I just, that's yeah, what Yeah, this just one did I me. would say is, you know, yeah, a little rich. Kind like of she like, said, yeah. I like that. Yeah. And my first sip of it, Seems kind speaking. of creamy, which goes with yeah, that butter. Like yeah, I don't, I, I don't know that tastes like butter, but I guess kind of in a way. I'm but still, that I'm feeling still of feeling it. it. I'm still feeling it. It's start. It's working in my chest now a little yeah. bit. Yeah, it's still in my throat. So what you got? Anything else? So the tasting notes from um from the distiller is for what? Oh, actually, both of these are weeded. So these are both ah. from a weeded mash bill. Weeded bourbon mash bill. Girl. Which means the second predominant grain is wheat. Yep. And this is a, the barrels for both of these are char number three. I think it says that on. Yeah. Hmm. I thought it said it on the bottle someplace. Maybe I just. Most times we don't always see the char number on there. That's yeah. just something geeky that we people always say. Geeky. Hmm. Geeky. Hmm? 
So the tasting notes <laughs> are this. Nutty, pepper, mm -hmm. cinnamon, mm -hmm. vanilla, mm -hmm. citrus, cinnamon, cinnamon get citrus, citrus slash orange, brown yeah. slash burnt sugar, mm -hmm. yeah. cereal. Yeah, I was going to say, well, it's because that's the wheat. The, yeah. um, the and field. then earthy slash grassy, yeah. Yeah. wood, corn, tobacco. Tobacco, I'd say, yeah. So the finish is smooth and rich profile with a touch of sweetness. That's, a, that's yeah. great, Maybe though. that's what my finish is, a tobacco. Yeah, well, I think tobacco more is the first one for me. It's a light. It, every All of them are very light, though. The light, the tobacco, and the grassy. So it's not oh, like a man. disgusting grassy or a yeah. disgusting... No. It's, it's all, all very... All, it's all very... Too. I mean, smooth is the word you got to use. Yeah. It's yeah. just, they all blend together really well. So they both smell completely different now. Oh yeah, yeah. they do. I, I noticed that when we first poured them. Man, oh pepper! I got the pepper smell on this cask oh, strength good. one. Good pick, Mike. Yeah. I wonder why you haven't seen. Why do we not see more of this on the uh, mm -hmm. interweb? Yeah, it's not like it's. I mean, it's relatively new, but yeah. It's, but don't you think? Because people, when, there's such people. Well, there are so many people who are so into bourbon now that they go with the the, the good old guys that are so. Like, that's the thing that no, it's like, oh, do you have a pappy? So when you tell me you you're a bourbon collector, do you have a pappy? No. Right. You know, I mean, right. someday I'd like to have a pappies of some sort, but I'm not going to pay crazy, stupid money for it. Mm -hmm. But, you know. But if you want to send us a bottle, we will we take it. Cry. No. And we'll review it. Just, yeah, yeah. we'll just review it. And we'll give you credit for it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so the, the retail on this is around 50, and the retail on this is around 70. And again, this one is the uh, um, single barrel cast strength. And this is the bottle and bond. So 1570 is their um, MSRP-ish. That's kind of, that's decent. Which is say that. yeah, what bad. I paid for, yeah. Yeah. Does he have more? He had a case of each. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, I, see, yeah. I was there before, Mike, and I seen the boxes setting. And he's like, aisle. you didn't open them? You're, you're like. I did not. because I've done that before. I've gone in. He wasn't it. there. And oh. I thought about it. And I seen the box and I was reading it. And yeah. I thought. I never heard of that one, so yeah. I passed on it, and then I got a picture later. Mike picked them up, so <laughs> like, that's, why I have, that's why we have our people. <laughs> Whatever I don't buy, Mike will, you know. So it well, goes I back sent him. To, I sent him a text, and I said, "You know, it's time." So yeah. I said, "Okay, I went." Said, okay. <laughs> so when I was there, he was there. Okay. Yeah. And I, um, I asked him. I said, "What's new and exciting?" And it's funny. He had this long receipt, and he's like, "No." Oh, and funny. then he and he stopped, walked around, and looked, and he pulled both of these out. And at first, it was just this one. Yeah. Um, but there were two boxes, one on top of each other, and he, then he opened up the other one, and it was this one, and they were different. And it's oh, so and I'm thinking in my head, okay, now I got to choose. <laughs> and it's like I said, well, you know, what's the price? Um, mm -hmm. I said, oh, I'll take them both. Because mm -hmm. um, again, seventy for a single barrel. Single barrel cast strength. Cast strength. Like that. We, um, we all like that. It's about mm -hmm. what, especially from a craft distillery, is about, yeah. about, you know, a, a going rate. So I'm not, we weren't getting hosed, we weren't getting screwed, we weren't, weren't getting taken advantage of. So, and 50 on this again. So I think that, I think those are good prices. Okay, so question. Do they make their own juice? Yes, it's yes. distilled and bottled by them. Okay, so yeah. they've been around a while, obviously. because At least four years. years. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think they. I think they have been there for a while, actually. I mean, I didn't. I didn't do my homework like I should have on these. But what? I know that's sad, right? I knew I should have said. Give it to Denise. Denise. Get the assignment. Yeah, Denise is in charge of the spreadsheet. But I'm impressed with them. Sad. I'm very impressed. I mean. Yeah. It's uh, it's good juice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I would agree. So if I had to pick between the two, I would definitely pick the cask strength. Mm -hmm. And I think I would pick it for the midi, I don't want to say inter, the intermediate bourbon drinker for sure. I wouldn't give it to a beginner. I don't think I'd give either one of these to a beginner. I wouldn't. Yeah. No, no. It would be interesting. I wouldn't give them this, this, this one. I would think about giving them this one as here's something that's different than yeah. what we started you mm -hmm. with. Yeah. Um, because again, I'm not getting the the hundred proof, mm -mm. so you're not going to overpower them with with proof. But definitely, that taste is is different than if you're if you're starting out on a collection of bourbon. Though I think these would be great additions to just um, add to the, to change up everything, mm -hmm. especially okay. that one. That one is really like a shocker when you smell it, taste mm -hmm. it. 
it's just not your typical bourbon, bourbon at all. This one's a little closer, but um, that one's just, it, it's, it's so different, mm -hmm. well, right? Yep. And it's a yeah. good different. I mean, sometimes you get different, it's like, ugh. Yeah, but. yeah that's good. So, let's see, how should we do this? Thumbs up, thumbs down, rating one to five. Um, yeah, well, yeah, I think one to five. One is to good. five. One yeah. to five. Okay. Yep. Okay. That one. This one. It, to me, for my palate, I'd give it. I give it a three. I was gonna say three, three and a half. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with a three and a half because I think it's uh, it's a good, it's good. We didn't say it's you could use decimals, guys. One, two, three, point seven, three, five, four, six, seven, five. Three. I'm, I'm doing a three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then for the, for that one, I would give it a four for sure, at least a four. I mean, I'm almost on the verge of a five. I think, I think a four. I'd give it a four. No four point anything. I'm gonna stay a three three. I'm not. I, I don't want to. I don't want to raise the bar too high because when we get to a four and fives, I think it's gotta be a really killer to be a five. Well, yeah. We may have to go start our scale at ten and give us. Yeah, a little I was gonna say, no, that's too broad. That's I just wanna. A three is still a great rating. I think yeah. it's something you yeah. Need. yeah. I think I'll add to my my collection mm -hmm. just because it's different yep. enough. Um, yeah. I think I'd do a three and a half. <laughs> you <laughs> well, you can't. said you can't. Oh, we can't. <laughs> okay. That's why I stay with it. It's on the verge uh, of a it, strong three. Yeah. A, <laughs> a strong three. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, All right. it's, it's very good. So I'm going to take this, this rating on a little different one because <laughs> another, another one of our podcast that we like to listen to the, they do this so is it a um a buy or a try it's a buy or a pass so i'm saying both are buys Absolutely. ditto i say buy for both either. for sure they already yeah. bought it buys. <laughs> well, <they're laughs> buys. Yeah, but we bought some things we didn't like <laughs> we're like dang it but yeah there's a couple things <laughs> they're for sure they're buys. buys and they normally don't buy stuff they don't try with from uh yeah, the yeah. Smaller, the we smaller always smaller try everything so but well, okay. we do, yeah. So we okay. like to, Definitely. yeah. Very good. Definitely. I, give it a try if you got a chance. I mean, pick it up. I think it would be something that you will definitely impress your um, guest with. No, for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, on that note. On that note. I still have some. Oh. Cheers. Ooh. Like, subscribe, and share. Again, Michael, Don, Brian, Denise, uh, Chasing Neat, and... The Bourbon Crew. The Bourbon, bourbon Crew. Some bourbon is for sharing. Yes. That's right. With friends. Some bourbon. Some, I like that. Some bourbons are good. What did you say? Some. Some bourbon is for sharing. Oh, yeah. Some. Top shelf. If you have to ask. If you have to ask. All right. Thank you. See Thank ya. you. Till next time. Awesome, nice. guys. <laughs> That's good.